UFC super fan, we are back doing another eBay show off. This is the same huge lot um, as before. This is part three of part five. Um, anyways, let's get to it. All right, got a lot of cards to show off. Just to remind you guys, um, this lot was a total of $55, so I got about 60 cards for 50, 50, 55 56 dollars so I thought it was a pretty good win. Uh, there's a lot of big superstars in here. No autographs, but um, nonetheless, some great cards. Alright, so, we got first one, Tito Ortiz, this is from UFC... Uh, I don't know what what the S is for. If that's an S or a 5. Oh, I see. This is from O. Ortiz Shamrock number 3. Numbered out of 50... Number out of uh, 88. 2011. Nice. Interesting. I think this is my first uh, Tito Ortiz Shamrock card. Next one, I think I have this one. This is Antonio Rodrigo Nogueira. Look at that, 2010 main event. Nice little card. Look at this, dual, dual gear relic. I love these. Um, Ryan Darth Vader versus one of the Nogueira brothers. Non-numbered. I forget who who won this one. I think I think uh, Bader won. I think. Next one, Stefan Bonner, American Psycho. This one is non-numbered gear relic. Cool card. Um, if I ever, I did meet him, but if I do meet him again, I'll get a little signature right there. Uh, that'd be sweet. You got Glover Teixeira. This one is out of 188. Um, he got beat up against Jones. Um, it was it was tough to watch. He had that cut over his eye. He was all busted up. He got his eyes poked. Uh, he got his knee kicked or his thigh. Uh, it was just a brutal, brutal fight. Uh, so I'm not sure where he goes from here. He snaps his 20 fight winning streak. Uh, so I guess it's back to the drawing board for him. Uh, but tough, tough fight against Bones. Uh, that's what happens when you fight the champ. Anyways, nice card out of 188. This one I was really looking forward to forward to getting. Um, Cain Velasquez Bloodlines Gear Relic. Mexico. This one is numbered out of 198, 196 to 198. Nice. Nice card. Any any card where I can get Cain Velasquez or any lot I can get Cain Velasquez, I'm always going to jump after him. Um, one thing I like about Kane is he signs everything. Um, you know, people look up to him. He's a great role model. Doesn't talk a lot of trash. He just kicks butt. Uh, my, my boy DC, he's fighting. Uh, I think in I forget not this pay per view, but maybe next pay per view against Hendo. Uh, it's gonna be a great fight. Um, this is a gear relic card. And this is numbered out of 188. And speaking of Hendo, who would you have it? Dan Henderson, Matt Relic, non numbered out of the 2012 Finest series. Um, I honestly think DC is gonna just manhandle him, size, strength take him down and just do some pretty good ground and pound on him. But Henderson has that one punch power, but we'll see. Um, anyways, I'm gonna put this back there since they're fighting soon. Got my boy Clay Guida. This one is 288 out of 288. Nice little orange matte relic. 
I wasn't a huge fan of these smaller ones just because I don't think it adds very much. I do like the larger ones where you can get fighters to sign it, but this one's tiny, so I don't think, um, I don't know. It might, might be worth signing if I ever meet him, but who knows. This one I was really excited to get premium pieces out of 88. My boy Gilbert Melendez. I think I, I think you guys have seen uh, his past autographs that I got, but nice little autograph right there would be perfect. This is out of not not out of from the 2013. I think this is my first 2013 premium pieces. Um, nice card though, very very nice card. And he's up against uh, Anthony Pettis. Um, I think they're going to be coaching the show pretty soon. I think. Maybe, maybe. Anyways, finally, last card. Frankie Edgar. This is from the Knockout Series. This is out of 188. Um, nice to always get a Frankie Edgar card. Good guy. Kind of been a staple of the UFC for a while now. Um, anyways. All right, cool. So that's it. Nice lot or nice part three. Um, I'll be doing the next ones coming up. Uh, so visit me at theflyingarmbar.com and UFC Superfan out.